everyone, Anna here coming at you with a beautiful face of black makeup on. <laughs> this is the detox mask that I absolutely love. It's Unique's detox mask. It doesn't feel like you just stripped your skin. It just feels really rejuvenated. Anyway, I am going through prescriptions that um, I just got a few and always next time when I refill some of my liquid medications or one of my ODT medications, the orally dissolving tablets, I will have to show you how big and how many bags I get because it's crazy when we first transitioned over to them because we realized I was going kind of crazy and I was not absorbing my seizure meds, which is kind of a problem. Those meds and brought them home, it was like four bags of, of uh, scripts, like of bottles and boxes. And it was like, um, and it was like, where do we put all this? So I had to just rearrange everything. There's, there's stuff everywhere in my room. It's bananas. It's totally bananas. But these boxes are, um, these, this is one of my nebulized medications for my lungs. So those have already, those have always, I've been taking these for over two years. So I've always had those in those boxes. And then, um, I got a couple scripts for headache medication, potassium, because you have to take the potassium with this. It's like a it's a duo. Oh, and you guys, it's so, we call it this the candy corn medication. And I'll show you. Do you see? It's because you have, it, it literally looks like candy corn. See? You have the orange, white, and the yellow. So that's pretty fun. It's not as exciting as it used to be when we first started getting them, but she still likes putting in the candy corn meds so if she's helping me and she's over here then i'm gonna be like you want to do that okay fine that would be great two more meds yes okay so this one is for sleeping sleeping is not overrated folks and you hear me all the time i'm so tired that's just a that's just a thing but still sleeping is not overrated your body needs rest and this one is something for my my lungs and also, also like my sinus area. Um, about three years ago, I started having really bad, over three years ago, three and a half years ago probably at least, I started having really bad swelling in my face. Um, like I can look back at pictures and see holy cow I had a lot of like you can see that um, and then it started to get really painful um, especially if I would back then I, I used to catch like a cold really badly and it would make me so sick and I would be in so much pain in my face it was unbelievable and it was just it was like I was like mom I want to go to the hospital but there's nothing they can do for me like I just wanted them to like poke a needle in my face and drain something out like I just felt so swollen and I was so swollen anyway when I started seeing my Lyme specialist in Washington DC they put me on this medication and Zyrtec and that really calmed down my sinuses. The pain mostly completely, mostly or completely, I can't remember, but it's completely gone now, that type of pain specifically. Um, and this medication is actually also used for, for um, asthma, for lungs, and to help uh, the immunological response of your your lungs because asthma is essentially an autoimmune disease where it's like attacking it, yeah 
So it kind of tries to just help that. So sinus, lungs, it's a really important medication for me. So got that all refilled because last night that was my last one. So got that. So I will be filling all my meds for the week probably later today. I guess I need to do that. I have done lots of medicalness today. Um, I called all the all the people, all the people. I called GI. I called Cleveland Clinic. I called. I had to make sure that my propulsive would be in, like my script for, because I won't be seeing my um, gastroparesis specialist for another three months. That's just how it's scheduled. So I need a script of propulsive for the next three months, and I only have a few bottles. So I just need to call and be like, um, so we figured that out. I had to call my primary care because they gave me the wrong time. And then it was a misunderstanding with the time I have to get an EKG tomorrow. So they're going to give me an EKG. We set up a different time for my appointment in the morning. I have to have that EKG because of, um, the propulsive and it can, um, it can, it, it sort of works a little on the electrical system of your body, so it can um, cause heart issues for some people who, ha who have heart issues or whatsoever. So they have to do EKGs um, every three months, but also when you bump up to a new, new dose. When I started the medication, I had to do uh, e an EKG a week later. I bumped up to the full dose now, so I have to do an EKG, and that's a week later. So I have that, and then I had to call my DME, my um, the medical supply company for my feeding tube, seeds, and supplies, and get that monthly refill and talk to them about specifically what I needed for the month. So far, that's all the people that I've called, and I'm waiting on a call back from one of them. But it was a success, surprisingly. It was a success. <laughs> I'm only waiting on one call back, which is pretty good, because usually you don't always get a hold of people <laughs> at the doctor's office. So I will talk to you guys later, and you're just going to come along my day with me. I got no idea what's happening, but here we go. <sighs> just did a live video on Facebook. Those of you who want to follow me on Facebook, the link is in the comments. Um, and I did a lot of work on my business. Need to go do more work. September, like I said, is my month. I'm striving toward getting back on track because this summer just went a little whoosh. Had a lot of things going on physically but also it just threw me off totally mentally so I'm just getting back on track anyway all that to say I feel like I've been so busy um, of course and now I took a step outside because it's so beautiful and it looks so beautiful outside and then you walk outside and then within two minutes you can't breathe well. I'm trying not to start coughing, but. <coughs> okay. I'm gonna say um, that coming outside was a nice idea. There's a beautiful breeze. Uh, but that's all I need to go back inside um, and rest take a little break before I do some more work maybe not maybe I don't know I can't even think and then I'm gonna say goodbye and subscribe if you want to see more of these videos I really appreciate that that means a lot to me and um, I will see you super soon. Bye.